Hello and welcome to News Update. According to a new discovery by the World Health Organization, the Omicron COVID-19 variant is more infectious than the Delta strain and decreases vaccine efficiency. President of South Africa Cyril Ramaphosa is currently receiving treatment after testing positive for COVID-19, his office says. The United Arab Emirates has reportedly barred other airlines from conveying Nigerian passengers to the country. The ruling All Progressives Congress has fixed Saturday, February 19, 2022, as possible dates for its highly anticipated national convention. According to security and medical sources, a Palestinian man was reportedly killed during an armed confrontation with Israeli forces in the northern occupied West Bank. Saudi Arabia has announced plans to post its first budget surplus in 2022 after almost 10 years. President Joe Biden has declared a major federal disaster in Kentucky and ordered federal aid to be made available to hardest hit areas two days after powerful tornadoes devastated several towns. The Director General of National Youth Service Corps, Brigadier General Shraibo Ibrahim, announced on Monday that Corps members will be required to show evidence of vaccination before they will be allowed into the camp for registration from the next orientation exercise in 2022. And that's the news update. You can get more from TOS TV Network using the details currently showing on your screen.